You gotta figure out an Eddie Murphy replacement. No thanks. Prince. Knock it off. No. But let it be if they keep going with this, they're gonna wash it out. It's gonna be done with. No, no, no. It's done right now. It's, it's it's, it was done in the eighties. They should have left it alone. You know, I get you wanted to do the Medea Tyler Perry ending type, of, like it. It just we are family at the end doing the electric slide. That's a classic Tyler Perry Medea family reunion move. Oh yeah, they definitely. I do. don't. Yeah. I, I I get the good feeling of it. I get what you're trying to do. Like, oh, we're all a family. It didn't go, man. It just didn't go. Keep it royal. Keep the royal tradition. Add the, the other stuff. But that they right there, I just feel like they did too much. Did, 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 like, I need that royal music. Yeah. I need that royal, like, bring, you can bring an American singer, but they, they just did too I enjoyed the music because I enjoy hip-hop, so I enjoyed the people doing their performances, but it was too much and I had to wrap my head around okay real royalty will go to different palaces and I mean real stars will go to different palaces and perform so you know maybe this is what's going on I had to wrap my head around that to accept it but I felt like it I was like okay y'all doing too much y'all didn't brought out Patti LaBelle, Lava LaBelle, Luca LaBelle and and who else ever it was just it was like after the 17th song, it was too and too much. And then you're being corny. Midnight Train to Zamunda. Like, get the hell out of here. That's This is corny. Just perform the real song, you know, and do the real royal songs for Zamunda. That's it. That's my thoughts on it. My fresh thoughts. Just got done watching it. And that's my thoughts on it. I give it that. A. They're going to wash it and run it in the ground. They're probably going to make a 3 and a 4 and a 5. And... I it's just gonna get worse and I worse. <laughs> it's just I mean they got a king, they got a, a prince, they got the girl that's gonna rule after he's gone. So then there's gonna be the some type of Wakanda like warrior princess type movie after that. I didn't, but I didn't see like the. I mean, for the there was no opening for the original one. Yeah, there was no opening. They created, they stabbed a hole in it with a freaking ice pick. And then ripped it apart just to make some raggedy, stupid ending. How do you fu- I mean, like that's just dumb. I mean, you talk, you're talking about the best movie ever, ever. made. Like you just you follow up that. Only thing, only good thing about it was black later. actors. Black actors was working. That's all I could say. Right. There's a positivity about it. That's the only thing really extra positive about it. Black actors was working during the pandemic, and <laughs> they had got to make some money. And bring out another movie. That's it. But uh, and it came out straight to TV. So obviously it wasn't meant for the. Uh, <laughs> they weren't for the bringing in no box office. <laughs> but maybe they are. Will be opened up. I don't know. But that's my thoughts and any wrap up thoughts because that's the end of what I got to say about it. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, you know, the production from the first one. I mean, we haven't seen a production like that. Uh, you know, aside from any you know action movies, but we haven't seen a production like that in just a real movie. I don't know when the last time we ever seen any production like that. That was immaculate production back in 1988 when they they did it. Um, yeah. I mean, and they knew it was going to be a smash. They knew. I mean, they knew what they had. They knew. They knew what they had. That's why they put all that money into the movie. They knew what they had with the original. They knew. They said Eddie Murphy is the best thing since sliced bread. Like, there is nobody like this guy. Like, he's smart. He's funny. He, he's he's an actor. We didn't know that. He's great. You know what I mean? Like, nobody's going to be better than this guy. You know, we're going to put all our chips in on this guy. And he 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 made it happen. He, he made all the characters happen. You know what I mean? All the characters fed off him, fed off his energy. You know what I mean? And uh, this one, I mean... If you can come with a coming to America too, I mean, look, dude, you just got to come with the best talent. Not, I'm gonna say the 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 the, uh, the mama, which is his baby mama. She was funny. I ain't gonna, you know, we know she's a comedian. You know, she's been doing this. You know, she'd been in all the all the uh, movies. You know, all the movies. She was funny. I ain't gonna say she was corny. She was funny. But uh, as far as the talent, you know. I mean, that's all my take on it, you know. Just the talent then, you know, it is what it is, you know. But I gave it a C plus. Again, you know, you guys watch it. Let us know how you feel about it, you know. But um, for me, C plus. All righty. And that's our review. Peace.